Whoever is a liar is trying to discourage you. Yes, my eh? God. You must always bring this girl here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, because there's a lot that God wants to do with this girl. Yes. But try to discourage you. Yes, Apostle. Because I see when she wanted to run, something happened. Yeah. Eh? Yeah. She wanted to run, something happened. She began to. Eh? You prayed for her last month. She, she was over cement. And she was here, but something happened. Yeah. She felt like there's a broken something inside. Whenever she must compete the following day, today, something must happen. So that she must not play but, soccer. But you are the cause of this. Of disobedience. Okay. You remember the prophet prophesying? Yes, I remember. About the car. I remember. And what happened? Okay. You are the cause of this thing. And now, devil wants to take, look how you progress. There was a time where you found a chicken. In my eh? church, yes. Eh? In my church, In yes. In your church. And it was cut off there. Yeah. Eh? But now, look what is happening to you. How God saved you. You're the cause. Can you just stand up? Can you write beginning of December? This thing, can you vomit this thing? Come on. <coughs> it, it's, if I can take you back, because I don't want to, because I must tell you direct, so that you see how Satan is fighting you. How you are so much connected. You understand? And then now, if you might have taken that prophecy serious, by now, you, you were supposed to be with big people now. You were supposed to be having people who are guarding you. You hear what I'm saying, sir? Yes, I remember. You know what I'm talking about? Mm, I eh? know, yes. Yeah, because there was... I just saw a president giving you something. Mm. A president giving you something. Yes. You were close to a president. Mm. It's not true. It's true. Eh? It's true. He wanted to give you something. Even tomorrow I'm invited. Where? In Pomalanga. So, listen to this. By them. Yes. By these people I'm talking about. Mm -hmm. So, say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I'm conducting prayer because of you now. Whatever Satan put as a trap in my life to delay my progress, I command it to come out. Can you cast that thing out? In Jesus' name. I'm concerned, sir. I'm concerned because. I say, I saw a president giving you some, I won't mention it here. It's a private thing. You understand? And you say you're going to the meeting tomorrow. Mm -hmm. But this thing can always happen where you find that you are with big people, but things are delayed. Exactly. But if you might have done what you've been told, it was a, because right now you were supposed to be dead by now. Yes, true. And God saved you. It's true. So therefore, whatever you have was called nothing. If you are dead, I mean, uh, I mean, a strong lion, the dead lion. Exactly. Exactly. It's not even better than a living dog. Mm. So now, whatever that you are heavy, if you might have listened, by now you were supposed to be far. I'm sorry to tell you this. I don't love to speak with people long time, like they don't hear. But I'm saying this because of what is happening yeah. now to you. Yeah. It's not only her, even your wife. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Huh? Exactly. There's too much attacks mm. in your wife. 
She's supposed to be taken to the sports school next year. But that's why I brought her today. This thing will drag and drag and drag. I'm sorry to to tell you this. Until you are you give up. And that's how certain want to hold you. Exactly. But if you might have take care. Don't tell anybody but just take just do it. At Giani. Huh? We were at Giani. Yes. If you might have done that, God loves you. <laughs> when I was speaking with you, I heard Ndovu. Who's Ndovu? I think it's the it's the secretary of the Pumalanga province. So you are going to meet that person in Pumalanga. Yes. You are going to be connected. Amen. So there's no more delay now. I want to say thank you. When I was... Uh, I'm Pastor Keiza Maswangani from Pumalanga. And the prophecy, yeah, is confirmed. I think we were in Guyana when Apostle said, I must give one of my cars. So I thought because it was a gift, I'd rather buy him a new car. And then from there we lost contact. So after that, my daughter, she's an athlete. She can run. But each time when she must compete, she plays soccer, netball, athletics. Each time when she must compete next tomorrow, today something must happen. So I never thought that uh, there is that promise which was not fulfilled. And it's true that the one chicken was slaughtered in my church, as you have said. And uh, lastly, I've got this favor to the politicians. But I didn't know what blocked me because... We, yeah, there's that uh, friendship, but find that when one to, to meet and discuss something, it must disappear. So. The book by Apostle Professor J.B. Makananisa, Every Christian Needs Deliverance, is now available at Amazon.com. Get your copy today. Shalom.